Hey everybody. So this week we're going to be uh, fixing the uh, 1973 CB350 4 After some goblins decided to uh, knock it over right here in the parking lot, we got uh, replaced some spark plugs and some ends and uh, I think the rear uh, turn signal bracket needs to be straightened out. So uh, why don't we get to that and uh, we'll get going. We'll see you in a minute. All right, guys, so <clears throat> first thing we gotta do is get the, uh, the old spark plug out. There we go. Okay, I'll take that nice and slow. I'm like, what the heck was that? Leaf. You guys can see how bad this one is messed up. The whole whole damn thing broke off. I've never seen a spark plug look like this. <laughs> look at that. You guys see that? Check that out. Oh, I think some water came out or something. <laughs> Who knows? Anyways, I, uh, I have one plug right here ready to go all right this is going to be a quick one this uh luckily there's not there's not too much damage done to this thing this dented the case here and bent this down we're just going to take this tab and try to bend this back level we'll have to, we'll do that from the back of the bike oh and then the plug uh, cap the actual plug uh, itself is was shattered off easy as cake it's a piece of pie if you guys have any stories of somebody some goblin smashing your bike let me know leave it down in the comments because uh, this pissed me off. I was like five in the morning. I was getting ready. To, six in the morning. I was going to work, and my wife said, "Is this spike supposed to be laying over like that?" And I said, "Laying over like what?" And I look out, and it's just laying there. I'm like, "Uh, no." Yeah. So I, I was like, "Yeah, we're, we're not gonna tell him yet. He's sleeping." <laughs> I picked it back up. We're on our way. I told him later when I got home, I was like, hey, come outside for a second. He thought, oh, shit, I'm in trouble. <laughs> I'm like, no, 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 you're not in trouble. But your bike is. All right, so this side, we've got like a, there's two styles. There's this style. These go on the outsides, one and four, two and three are a little bit different style. So we got to find the plug that looks like this one. I bought all four, you know, Plugs. I'm guessing they're probably going to be the ones in the bigger box here. I got all this off of, um, yeah, whoa, 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 what's all this junk popping out here? David Silver Spares. Mm. Actually, oh yeah, and the rubber's on the end, and this is on the end. It looks just like that one. It looks just like that one. So this is the one we're going to use. And I'm assuming the, uh, the rubber bit's got to go on first. I 
gonna say put some put some lube on it, and then I was gonna put up a meme of the Huck to a girl, but mm. I I think she's stupid, so I'm not gonna do that. How dare you! <laughs> we'll come up with something else. There we go. Thread this on. A little bit more twist on it. Come like that. All right. Now we can back the truck up. If I can get it, let me put this out of my hand here. All right. Very nice. And then we'll do the same thing on the bottom. Right like that. And we will just plug her in. Come on, plug in. Plug in. There we go. All right. And that's it. Um, what we'll do is I'll reset up the cameras and uh, then we will um, fire her up. We'll see you in a minute. Let's get the key and uh, see if we can get her to start. She's been running a little, little while, but I'm hoping that that's all right. Okay. All right. There we go. I was like, what's up with that key switch? A little sticky. All right. We got 11.6 volts. We'll turn in our... Let's turn the idle way back. Looks like he left it way, way out. We'll put it somewhere in the middle-ish. Okay. Clutch in. Bike's on. Help if you open the gas. Okay. Gonna crack the throttle a little bit. Let's, uh... Oh, what about the choke? Choke is on. All right, let's turn the choke off. There we go. All right. You guys see this stealth little voltage gauge that I put down there? Isn't that cool? You can't even see it from the rest of the bike, but at least you know what your voltage is. Let's uh, crank that up a little bit. Mm. All right. We'll let that warm up for a minute, and then uh, I think we'll uh, we'll take it for a ride. What do you think? Hang on. Let's jump on this thing and ride. We still got to fix the uh, the turn signal, but we'll get to that. Brakes need some work, but let's turn this thing off. Man, that's awesome. Brakes work, everything works. Let's uh, let's look at the last thing we're going to do is look at this uh, turn signal back here, and uh, we'll be right back. Let's uh, let's see if we can get this. Let me come around. To the side here because you can see it's pretty bent all right that's an... <sighs> how's that look ah even this one like that one looks good even this one looks a little bent. We'll fix that too. There we go. That's looking pretty good. All right. We'll get up. We'll take a look at what we've done. <laughs> 
and uh, she's back out ready for the road. Get ready to rip on her. All right, guys, so that's it. Um, pretty quick one. We're gonna, at some point, I'll replace the other three spark plugs. Um, but uh, she's firing on all four cylinders again. We bent up our brackets. There's not much I can do about the uh, the dent and the time in the points case. You know, well, technically, it doesn't even have points. It's got electronic ignition now. So, but other than that, we're all good to go, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna take a break on the Harley this weekend. Uh, tomorrow, I think I might actually finally change the oil on the Rebel. Uh, I got some more parts coming for the Harley too, and I had a really awesome conversation with these guys over at NWT Electronics. Uh, I'm considering working with them, you know, buying their product. Not, you know, not that they're going to give me anything, but uh, working with them to get a basically electronic digital setup on the Harley, which would be really cool. Um, you know, turn signals, starter, all that kind of stuff. So that's going to be pretty epic. But uh, you know, we have to have to wait to you know get that. I got to confirm a few things from them, and then uh, we should be good to go. So. We'll see you guys in the next one, all right? Easy.